Here at the top, search in Inkpad, Inkpad, and Notepad. Here it is. So before I install this application, I just want to let you know that this Inkpad Notepad is simple, elegant, easy to use, easy way to keep notes on your phone or on the web. So let's go ahead and install it now. So you can take a look at the example images here. So to do list, shopping list, class schedule, flight, email, you can, you can uh, put titles on your pad. Next slide is you can do like something like this, class schedule. You can even put up some, put something like a check mark on your to-do list. Then you can create tags, colors, change the colors, just like that. So as you can see, the interface is really great as well. And you can access your notes online at inkpadnotepad.com, which is really handy. So let's go back and open it now. So it says here, Inkpad Notepad, keep your notes safe. If this device is broken, is ever broken or lost, access your notes from other mobile devices, access your notes from your computer at inkpad.com. So you can sign it with your Google or connect it with your Google, or you can just skip it. So for, for me, I'm just going to skip it. Without logging, your notes will not be saved online. So that will be fine. I will just hit OK. So continue, selecting continue privacy policy. Just press continue. And here it is. You can now add it. So content, you can, you can now type in the content in here. Let me just turn on my internet so that So the ads are now gone, which is great. So you can use this application online or offline. So the settings here that says login, you can use, you can change the team if you want to. So these are the teams available for this application. So the free version has only three teams, the default one, the second one, the bright and the monochrome. So as you can see, it has a lock. So these are the premium features. If you want to use this night mode team, then you have to purchase this application at Play Store so that you can, so that this will be unlocked and you can use the team. So let me just go back in here now. Add the settings again, all notes. So I, as you can see, I don't have any notes yet. All notes, zero trash notes. So notes that, that, that you will be deleting uh, later on. So it will be put on the trash notes and you will see the numbers here. How many notes you have trashed or put on the bin. So upgrade to premium. So the premium version doesn't have ads even if you're connected to the internet, unlimited sync, meaning you can uh, connect your Connect this application to your cloud storage and pin lock code. You can put some security security lock to your notes. Settings. Let's take a look at here. Reminder. Pin lock. You can set up a pin lock for your notes. Change the team, font, size, sort by order or display type. You can customize the settings according to your needs, but for me, I'm just going to leave everything as it is, since everything is fine here. You can uh, customize the lock pin to make it more secure. So as you can see, there's a pop-up message here. You must have a premium ThinkPad account to use this feature. So as you can see, this feature is only available for a premium version. So for pre version, it, it doesn't apply this uh, option. So let's go ahead and add a notes now content let's put the title let's say grocery list grocery items content let's say eggs potato cheese sandwich 
what else uh, macaroni so here I here is the list that I need to buy at the grocery store later on so you can save it once you're done you can now press the check mark oh I'm sorry you can put the check this check mark here so that you can have it, you can have it customized like this so you can just press if you if you let's say for example a scenario where you are at the store and you already bought the eggs and potato then you can just select select it and then press the and put a check mark meaning that you already bought eggs I already bought potato or cheese and so on and so forth you can even add list add more list if you want to by pressing the plus button okay so that's how you use this application okay it doesn't save okay so here it is this this one here you can save it you save it now just like that and it will be available here notes saved so there's a prop pop-up message below let's add another one the title uh, for the title, let's say movie list, movie list. So I haven't watched, um, let's say Samurai X. Um, what else? Uh, Venom 3 or Venom 2. Spider-Man Transformer Transformer So once you're done you can now press this one here to sell sell the Oh as you can see it's automatically saved if you're going if you go back here pressing by pressing that option so the movie list is already automatically added to your list so you can uh, add more like um, appliances appliances so TV karaoke um, on, uh, PC a PC PS5 and so on and so forth can put a check mark if you want to and then save go back and as you can see it is added in our list so you can uh, press the three dots at the top right portion and then this option will be available so sync online sort from agency sort by date add notes remove ads to remove ads you need to upgrade to the premium version you can go to settings the same as here settings just like that so that's how you use this application and it's really really uh, helpful if you have a lot of notes to be saved on your phone or you can access it anywhere if you upgrade it if you upgrade this version to a premium version so again uh, as I have already mentioned that notes are automatically saved you don't have to do anything spe special to save them it will automatically save here it will be made available here and backup notes you can use by default by the way notes are backed up to your SD card as text files you can uh, turn this feature off in the notepad settings in here So as you can see the backup, here it is, auto backup, backup, backup notes to SD card. You can turn it on or off. So it's up to you. So I also want to let you know that you can share notes. So let's say that you want to share this. So to add, by the way, this for I want to add this option here that let's say that you want to add to this app to these notes you can just press this plus button and then 
you can create a new tag you can add add more just like that and then it will automatically save to your to your notes so that's how you use this application and thank you so much for watching this is mike have a wonderful day